Hello anatomy friends, this is Dr. Alsup and welcome to station number 14 where we are going to look at those large superficial back muscles. And really we are focusing on these two most dominant pairs of muscles. The more superior muscle is going to be the trapezius, which you will have a right and a left trapezius, which I am outlining right here. And recall that it's going to have its more proximal attachments all the way up in terms of the occipital bone on that uh, external occipital protuberance and some other portions there. And then it will continue to have its um, attachments on the spinous processes. And then we'll have distal, distal attachments to the clavicle, the acromion, and the spine of the scapula. So when it contracts, it will directly affect the actions of the scapula. So um, supposedly kind of trapezoid shape, and that is where it is getting its name. Um, but if you remember, it's going to be that more superior one that will help to differentiate from the also large, um, but more inferior latissimus dorsi, which I am outlining here. So the latissimus dorsi is, as I mentioned, going to be more inferiorly placed. It will also have proximal attachments on spinous processes, but also in terms of this thoracolumbar fascia that you can see right here in the, um, the lower portion of the back, more towards the midline. But importantly, in terms of its distal attachment, it will extend all the way to the proximal humerus. So you can see that we kind of lose the latissimus dorsi um, because we can't see the humerus well in this particular image. Um, so that is why we can't see that distal attachment as well. And those are those two large muscles. I think um, in comparison to some of the other muscles, since um, they have such an expansive attachment sites, they're typically a little bit easier to identify. But if you have any questions about the specifics of the trapezius and latissimus dorsi, please always feel free to reach out with any questions. Thank you for your time here, and let's move to the next station.